What's up, everyone? Welcome to another episode of Ronji.com's Garage Sale Transformer Store Finder, or GSTF2 for short. In this episode, we're now going to look at these G1 toys that we got for cheap. They're they're not cheap. They're just they're five dollars each, effectively. And uh, we've shown you them before uh, in an episode, but we haven't really transformed them in front of you guys. So we're going to do that today. Uh, of course, we've already looked at Sea Spray. He's damaged, so we're not going to try to force to transform oh, him that. today. But we do have here Aerial Bot Air Raid. Air Raid. Yeah, Air Raid. And um, this is Decepticon Run Amok. Run Amok. The twin brother of guy. Runabout. Can you say this guy's name? Yes. This and is this a guy Protectobot is... and the First Aid. Aid. This is a Protectobot and his name is First Aid. Unfortunately, he wasn't able to protect himself. His right hand is damaged. Um, as and like we were saying, this guy is part of the aerial bot, so he can actually become the arm or maybe foot. Uh, does he become guy, a foot or an arm? arm. Okay, so this guy also becomes an arm of yeah. defense. So the way to do that is basically that their head you can see there's a little um, or their head becomes the sort of uh combiner port. Uh, this one attaches to Silver Bolt and they form Superion. This and then you, attaches... you you attach a um a hand there. This one it attaches to uh the leader. Uh yeah, I forgot his name. The blue guy. Blue? Yeah. Hot maybe hot spot? Yes, or maybe hot spot, I forgot. Anyways, so uh yeah, same thing. This guy hot his hat his head becomes sort of the uh combiner port and then that way there's where the hand attaches. But this is him in robot mode and we're gonna now transform these guys into vehicle mode. This guy is not in great shape, but that's fine. So overall, 20 Canadian dollars for these guys, guys um, especially for me to get this guy, something. is great. What is it, buddy? The, the leader of the Protectobots is Hotspot. Oh, cool. Thanks for confirming that, buddy. So anyway, let's transform Air Raid into vehicle mode. And to do that, you just need to flip this forward and flip this backward. And flip these up and flip these down. And that's about it. It's a lot of flipping, but he looks very neat, very 80s. Yes, uh, die cast parts, nice metal paint, parts lots, of, the legs. lots of uh, stickers. The legs are metal, I think. I think the chest is metal maybe but so and just as a special for you guys we did these this guy a long time ago but this is the newest version of air raid i believe this it's is movie. yeah from the movie but he wasn't really in the movie but he combines with silver sil well yeah silver bolt to form the new superior and so this is what he that? looks like and just to compare they look very different this i like this better this looks more like a jet to me i guess uh yeah we in the newer ones they have copyright issues and things like that so they're not able to really get a real jet in i mean look at that how can this guy even fly in real life at least this guy has real wings okay um now we're gonna try to tr just tr Okay, we'll leave Air Raid first in the back. Um, we're gonna try to look at Run Amok. Run uh, yeah, sure. So yeah, that's him. I can. There's a reveal the shield kind of thing. Let's see if it still works. Let's see if it still works. Yep, I saw. I see a Decepticon logo there, but it's quite obvious from there. So my little assistant so will anyways, up here, buddy. Anyways, we'll transform it's it. basically easy. First, we have to flip that up, then pull the arms back. Mm -hmm. Then f you can see the heels are the wheels mm -hmm. that rhymes. Flip the wheels up and snap it in place. Mm -hmm. Then you flip this. You flip this like that. The foot. 
Yeah. And backwards and, and then, then you slide it in. And that's it. I think one of the features of this guy too is um he's he's pull back, see? He has that pull back mechanism. Whoa, watch him go. So that's the special feature of these guys. And they can supposedly I don't know if they they automatically transform once they hit something. So it's a very fast transformation. Let's see if he will transform. Nope, not really. Yeah, see that's a it's quick a step. It's basically yeah, I think he it's just it, with enough speed he should transform pretty fast. Let's try it again. So let's say Yeah, pretty much that's what will happen. He will transform automatically more or less. So the wheels are the heels, he keeps on rolling around. Yep. The best part is that the wheels are heels. Yeah, that's a nice looking 80s car. I love it. You know, the 80s car designs, those are the first cars that I loved. <laughs> Knight Rider, I guess. And maybe a few other stuff. But So this is first aid. So you can see, yeah, typical G1 design, not nothing much. Transform him, just drop down the well, move, flip forwards at that part. This is his backpack. Uh, tuck in his arms. This is his broken arm, as I said. I'm just gonna tuck it in as well. And then we're gonna flip this backwards, his legs, and then push it up. And that's Uh, Protectobot first aid. first aid for you. Really, really nice looking. Obviously, scale wasn't a problem, wasn't an issue yet back then. And this, this guy, we're not gonna transform him anymore because he's um got actually got dirty. That's why. He yeah, he he probably used to be white, but not anymore. And he even used to have a an Autobot sticker there, but it doesn't work. He also has this reveal the shield gimmick. Let's see if it'll work. The air raid has a read. Oh yeah. The shield. I just see think. if it will work. Yes, he does. Oh boy, oh boy. That's difficult. Anyways, so we're not gonna transform that guy, but this guy, um, we're gonna transform him. You wanna transform air raid back into robot so mode while I transform this guy? Shield. Oh yeah, you can try to do that too. I'll transform this air raid from the movie line. Let's see what how it goes. Nope, uh, it doesn't work. So first, flip down the front of the jet. Then you flip up the arms. But don't pull it down yet. Because you need to flip this front. And then you can let the arms go down. Flip this front. Then you can let the arms go down. And then you flip this up. And then flip that like that. Then you pull this up. Make space for that. And then pull it front. There is G1. Air Raid, Air raid actually. Yes, and speaking of, and here is movie air raid. Look at the difference. Hey, what? Hey, where's Obviously, his hands? You see, this guy looks a lot better. Uh, I mean, this guy's not bad. It's just he's not a movie toy, but they made him a movie toy. Look at that. Very nice. I mean, yeah, that's more like a G1 design, but of course, from the, two, I mean, 20 years later, and this is a G1 design a long time ago, uh, so long it's time not bad. Ago so, um, and that's Air Raid for you, this is Air Raid, the newer one. By the way, just to show you this guy, so when I reviewed this guy, when I first tried to transform him, 
I didn't know who he was exactly or what he was for, Who's so the I white didn't know. Version of that guy? Yeah, you can figure out from the book, buddy. Cause th so this guy is the black uh, plane, and one one other guy is uh, somebody else. But I I saw some combiner aspects of this guy, and I think so. Here, there's like a combiner port. I think we can separate him by doing that. And flipping this out, which looks like a combiner port. Uh, oh, how do you flip this guy out? There's something like that. Or maybe that's just where the hand or the arm goes, I don't know. But, um, well, we're not going to use him. We don't have a silver bolt that he can connect to and the white, the white all that stuff. But he looks pretty nice actually in this mode. So I'll keep this guy in this mode. little bonus content for you guys. Fortunately, we don't have newer versions of Run Amok or First Aid, which is unfortunate. But... And of course, how to white, transform this guy is very jet, simple. The yes. not silver bolt is slingshot. Oh, okay. Can I transform this guy? Pretty. Okay. How do I? You want to transform this guy? Sure. So easy, huh? It's so goes. cool. How Not about one step changers step. from back in the 80s? So first you pull out the legs, then you flip it back. Spin it around. Flip the front of the vehicle back. And then, I don't know how you get the hands out exactly. But, somehow... Oh, you have problem. Yeah, I'll do it. It's, uh, it's actually you have to hold it from both ends, and then that's do it. Hold it from well, in this case, just one end. Okay, that's difficult. Um, he has a tab somewhere. And then just for. Oh, never mind. Just for no, comparison. Yes, and for comparison, here's our Legends class figure. You can see he's about as tall as those. These one. guys. Yeah, well, one minute. And of course, this guy is more like Scout class. This guy is pretty small. This guy is pretty small. Uh, these guys. Okay. Of course, this guy is a mini bot, and that's why he's small. And just an, another comparison, sorry about the angle. Here's our deluxe class figure, classic deluxe class wheelie. And last but not least, I'm gonna show you a. Um, another speed sea spray? No. Um, very small figure. Sea spray, of course, in the new Power of the Primes line will be comparable in height to Bumblebee right here. But just show you guys, so those guys at least are larger than the Micro Masters, of course, they're Micro Masters. Yeah, this guy's the smallest. But also, um... Why not a mini box? Or a mini con that trick out? No. Oh, this guy's scout class. So we're gonna get a scout class. I'm, I'm Bumblebee. Sure this is from poor war. No, this is scout class from Mars in this robots in disguise. Um so you can see that this guy is scout class. What class are these guys? Um they're basically in between. Um you said G1 can be any class. Oh, Legion class. Here's Legion class. Check this out. Legion class Optimus Prime. He, even he's taller than those guys. 
So who this will... is guys. Well, they're approximately Legion class, smaller Legion class. And this, this guy's guy... of course Micro Master. Maybe size. Micro Master class. Skull class, Legends class, Deluxe class. Oh, we don't have Legend, a Warrior class. Legion, Deluxe, Small Legion, Micro Master class. This guy is Legends. Daddy. Yeah. Run amok is Legends class. Yep, that's correct. And last but not least, here's a um, warrior class figure. He's also taller than everybody, basically, but shorter than Wheelie. And that's about it for our family photo. Family. Hope you like this episode. Actually it's, an, actually, it's a Transformers family because Except it has. Except for a, that guy, yeah. Yeah. This it's guy a, is the only Decepticon in so the picture. So it's an Autobot so family. So he's hiding. Except ha, for ha, that ha, guy. Ranamok is spying on the Autobot family. Yeah. Hey, hope you liked this episode. If you liked this episode, please click the thumbs up icon and click the subscribe button. There's also a notification bell icon, ding, 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 ding. which you can click to get notifications of new episodes once they come out. So from our channel. And there's also a comment section down below if you would like to send in some comments and suggestions. We'd love to hear from you. Last but not least, there is a share button. Please click the share button and share this video with your friends, your loved ones, your families, everybody you know, including your enemies, so that maybe they'll start to like you. But until then, that's it for this episode. Uh, well, Autobots, wrap up and... Whoa, this guy's not so much of a one-step changer going. Rev up! Oh, and of course he's not a, an Autobot. Autobots, rev up and roll out!